Hey guys, it's the Soil Clock King today, and so this monster analysis video, we're going to be going over UV Fusion, and then I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not she is worth getting out of her current breeding event. So let's go and get right into it. Alright, so UV Fusion is a support, and her traits are hardened at rank 0. Rank 1 has Evasion, which is very, very good. And then rank 3 has Positive Effects Protected, which is also pretty great, because it can protect that Evasion. That is probably the best thing you can do with that, is protect the Evasion, which is very amazing. And then our relics are Banner and Staff, which are both pretty great. Now let's go on down to the pros and the cons. So we have Absurdly Great Status Caster. They're both just really, really good. And then she also has Amazing Speed and Relic Slots. Decent Life, Access to Trait Disabled, and Great Supporting Gimmicks and Evasion, Turn Transfer, NER, and Stamina Restoration, which are all really, really good. And then our only cons are No PER and Vulnerable to Anticipation, which is true. Now let's go on down to the moveset. So she has a team evasion with a 30% stamina restore. That is a very amazing move. She also has an ally NER with an extra turn, which is really great as well. And then she has a trait disable with an extra turn, which is really good. And then you can pick between a self evasion with positive effect protection and 30% stamina restore and stamina regen, which is really good. Or a team NER with stamina regen, which is also just really amazing. Both of those are very, very good in different ways. So yeah, she has some amazing moves. Of course, her traits are just really great. Especially if you can get her to rank 3, this is definitely a monster that you want to rank up all the way to rank 3. Because she does get like 10 times better if you can get that rank 3 positive effect protected. So yeah, definitely go ahead and get UV Fusion out of the breeding event and try to rank her up if you already have her or if you get her early on and you have enough time to rank her up because she is definitely worth it. Even just rank 1 is very, very good. So yeah, go ahead and get UV Fusion. Her moves are also really, really amazing. She's got NER, she's got positive effect protected, and she even has an AoE NER, which is very good. So yeah, go ahead and get UV Fusion. She's a very good monster to have. And let me know down in the comments what you guys think of UV Fusion. And I'll see you in the next one. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.